let's see how phone authentication plugin works in v4 so we go to login and click on sign in via mobile number then we enter our mobile number login and we'll see a google captcha challenge we fill in the captcha then we get an otp on our mobile phone we fill in the otp and confirm the code on confirmation we are logged into our account this is for a existing user with registered mobile number in WPLMS so let's see how it works for a non registered number so we follow the same process we fill in the mobile phone and we fill in the Google captcha And then we get the OTP in our mobile phone and we fill in the OTP. Now here it asks us to connect the, the number with a account. So we can either create a new account or fill in the details for an existing account. And as soon as we do that, our mobile number is connected with the account. And just to verify this, we can go to the profile and edit the profile fields. And here we'll see the updated mobile field number so let's take a look at the settings now here we only need to ensure that we have a phone number field and it should be of type text box because the numbers are with country code and this next thing we need to ensure is that in the YPP settings we have selected the phone authentication as login and map the buddy press text box field with the phone field other important settings include the firebase so we go to the firebase project and edit our firebase project and here in the authentication tab we go to the sign in method and enable the phone you can also add testing phone numbers to test the OTP and account creation also make sure that you have your domain added in the authorized domain of your Firebase project that's it from WPLMS tutorials